Hi, I'm Karthik from Fisherman Training Institute, Salala. I welcome you all for this session. In this session, I'm going to teach you how to create a HTML feedback page, an expression before. Once again, I repeat the topic: how to create a HTML feedback page, an expression before. Let me see right now. Open Microsoft Expression Web Form just by clicking the icon. And now, first step, what I'm going to do is I'm going to insert the form tag between the body tags. Form followed by the name. Let us say me. You can it give any name. Then close the form tag. And in between this form tag, because we are going to use form control if you are not using the form tag each and every time when you use the control it will create a new form tag so better to use the form tag first and then i'm going to insert a picture just select the picture insert you can ask for the rename or sorry alternate text give the text as fti click okay and later you can if you resize search make it smaller and then type your name training institute salala so i want this font to be bigger so select the font let us say h1 it's more bigger okay select this let us say add into which comes in your new line so what i'm going to do is select the text and put default size and make it extra large okay select the text go to default size and select double x dot okay fine and next i'm going to make center alignment and then i'm going to insert a table let us say 2 into 3 or 2 into 4 next so first i'm going to select two columns and then right click then use the option modify next let's say fisherman joining institute feed then select the text default size make it large and make it bold and make it center and if you want to provide if you want to give the background color so just click anywhere on this row right click select row. first you want to select the row and then this a background you can select the background apply it okay, fine and next let us say name so what we have to do is we want to insert an input box to enter the name so we can able to decrease the size Just delete this and delete this because see our form tag has been closed here. So just cut it and 
raised up at the table and before now you see the alignment okay now it's good so just let the table and make it bigger and next let us say college name so again an input text box somewhat bigger in size you can increase or decrease the size and college name let us say and address so if it is a case i want to use text area to enter the college name and address and next let us say student info so information so for this also we can use text area to enter the details of the student and then let us say mobile number so first what i'm going to do is i'm going to use a drop down box for entering the country code let us say to so now i want to insert some more value how to do this yes good the answer is use tab if you want to create a new row see a new row a new row has been created okay so now i want to do rating okay let us say excellent i'm going to use video because user can select any one of this let's say good and average let's say and next i need one more row use tab and let us say comments so for comments you should use text area last i want to use the submit button double click so i'm going to make it right alignment and double click it let us say submit click the thing and here i'm going to enter reset so double click it let us say reset and click okay now your form is ready so if you want to give the border select the table here is all border you can assign the border now you see you can do like this and how to run this what do you have to do yeah right before running this you want to save it go to save let us say create new folder let's say feedback let's say feedback or extra now the html web page has been saved now it's time to run okay so here's your option click here select the browser now you can able to see now you can enter your name okay let us say okay so i can use enter Electronic 
Jesus. Foundation. Mobile number. Select the mobile number and you can enter the mobile number. Let us say go to let's say excellent and commands. God. And you can submit it. And if you want to clear the values, you can use reset. Okay, this is how you want to use the form controls. I think you guys may enjoy this video. Thanks for watching this video. Thank you.